Good morning. The date is February 16th, 2012, for those who take note of such things. The weather outside is sunlight with some clouds in the way. Fix is a breakfast of kings. A king who likes toast and eggs and bacon. So it's like, yeah, I'm filming right now. So it's, Hey, I'm in Amsterdam now. This is, oh this is Tom. We're yeah. at the Blender Institute. That's great. I uh, made it. Uh, sure. You should have that one connected to YouTube. This is this is Tony. I'm oh. filming his face. Good morning. This is my first morning living over here in Amsterdam. This is the view out the window. It's still a little bit dark, but uh, you can see quite a bit. It's a big window. It's currently 8 in the morning. In Seattle, this would be rush hour. But over here, it's... Empty. Ah! I think that is where all of that beer comes from. The eggs over here are actually yellower. And that's not like a, you know, oh, the grass is greener type thing, because who says the eggs are yellower? But it's true. Film, we can't actually, because we have a song that is not Creative Commons in the background. Uh, so... <laughs> We, we had to turn off the music because it wasn't Creative Commons, but uh, we've just decided we're going to finish the entire first pass of the storyboard tonight because David is insane and we're going to storyboard until midnight, which is super awesome and I approve this message. The best thing about storyboarding till midnight is Ton gets you burgers. That ain't that yes. bad. That's happy, happy world. So, oh, it's a sneak peek. <laughs> oh, no. No, we do, we'll just upload it to the blog soon, so, you know, whatever. Enjoy Amsterdam like this. <laughs> Well, this is typically the Dutch weather. At least it's so rainy, cold, and windy. Yeah. Today we are cooking with David Revoy as he shows us how to cook the amazing French masterpiece <laughs> of boiling water. Yes. For doing good boiling water, you first need some water. And water can be occasionally thrown on this type of device. So you have to turn cold or warm, but if you do some mistakes, you can always rely to the color code here. Oh yeah. Yes, and this is the most important part. Because if you have some problem with vision, you can't actually know if it's cold or if it's warm. And that can totally mess your boiling water. Can you squeeze the water to test for ripeness? Don't do it at all. Yes. Oh, oh it feels it feels very medium. Yes. Yeah. This is David's secret recipe. Uh, no. this is Pan of pork soup. <laughs> this mm. is actually an epic fail. But I have to learn the Dutch products, you know. So first the pork, well then the pork I was wanting. Then the cream, well then the cream I was wanting. The onion was pretty okay. The salt. Uh, the salt... Is a bit weak. Oh, oh. Yes. Are we, you accidentally dropped all of this pasta in your boiling water. It's yeah. ruined. Mm. Yes, totally improvised. It's not a recipe that exists at all. So you get to name it, right? That means you, you, you invented it, you get to name it. Yes. I named it. Not yet. I still think about it. But. All right, all right. After the meal, after the meal, we'll find Maybe, out what the name yes, is. Maybe, after the meal. Okay. The meal is finished. David, what is the name of this amazing meal we just had? This was awesome rice. It is day six, and the madness has sunken in. There are so many robots. So many. The madness has taken us over completely. I see... I see a bright light. Yes. Elephant's dream. Makes sense now.
Now the entire Blender community will get to see Tons driving! <laughs> I think he just ran over a kid. Running old of old ladies. Oh no, Ton, look out for that windmill! No, no. We are now lost somewhere in the outer reaches of Amsterdam. Storyboards have been completed. Well, I did a first pass, and David is David is currently polishing up. Color. Oh, color! <laughs> oh, oh, that's super great. He's currently making them awesome, and uh, and so I I found myself puttering around for a moment, going, well, what should I actively be working on? That's when I realized, at the store there is chocolate. So. I'm gonna go on a trip to get me and uh, and David some chocolate because he needs energy. Look at him. Oh, he's he's drooping. So we need to get him some some chocolate. They said we can't we can't ruin the film, but they want to see stuff. So it's like, it how do we reconcile that? Five per frame. So with five minutes. Ah, yeah. Well, the question of the week: When you make a big scene in Blender. And in time, it's it's go very slow, like, and I hate it. I make very big scenes, and I want to fix that. So, Ian, how can I fix that? Well, Rob, this was shown to me by Mr. Nathan Begdahl. He actually changed, in my version of Blender, this certain button to read the magic button, because you check it, and all of a sudden, everything goes faster. So what we need first is a scene that is too complex for this machine to easily deal with, which is hard on this machine. <laughs> Because they're pretty good. Oh. So let's see. Yeah, well, what? B. Why isn't Z working? That's interesting. Okay, here we go. Yeah, We're getting there. there. We go. It's dark. And solid. Why is it only showing? <gasps> because these are all smoke. Oh, they're all. I deleted the wrong monkeys. Okay, anyways. Um, this is now. See, there's a little lag there. Yes, there's lagging. So we go into the preferences. User preferences, go into uh, system, check VBOs. Ooh, this, VBOs. Is the, this is the checkbox, vertex buffer objects. Apparently, it's unstable with certain graphics cards or something, but overall, check this out. No way. See that? See that? I knew that three years before. All of a sudden, oh, you knew that? That cost me a lot of time. <laughs> You, oh, did you already know that? I didn't know this. But see, see that? Look, this look at that. That's so smooth The best smooth day now. of my life. Oh. Guess who's here? Sergey's here. What's your eyes? Using a calculator and two computers. Yeah. Three machines must be used to calculate what is in Sergey's mind. I, so, I got one time good problem and so we're about, we're about to go get pizza and Sebastian here has actually never ridden a bike before in his life. What? So this is going to be super funny. We're now mounting his bag onto the back of the bike with a uh, internet cable. This is just, this is like knocking little holes in the dam, in the dike. He fell in the canal. <laughs> Because you have that one point, and I try to track that, and it doesn't work. It's coming. It's coming. Oh, it's so great. Really. Amsterdam is so absolutely great. We like that. Yeah. Awesome. You want to come to Holland? It's great. Director weekly update number one. Yes. No. We are I'm all eating Thai food. Oh, look I'm at this. This is so great. We're about to go back to our apartment for the first night. With Francesco and Karen, 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 and uh, <laughs> is he going to be called Korman? Why <laughs> not? What? Korman? Korman Krachton. Wait, is that his name or is that very good in Dutch? Krachton. 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 Oh my God! That's great job. 
Actually, they, they were they were. We didn't like it. Except for Sergey. <laughs> Sergey. <laughs> Sergey hated. It. He was just glaring at us the entire time. We didn't like it. We said it sucks. It really sucks. Yes. It's not enough fire. <laughs> not enough fire. We want more fire. It's totally not true. More fire. Violence, right? Violence. It's totally false six tenths. Yeah. It was really good. I, I didn't know. How were people going to respond? But yeah, they liked it. And we still have l nine weeks before we actually shoot. So that's... A baby could go from being born to being nine weeks old in that time. How, how many how many trailers did they use on, on The Hobbit? Uh, 140, apparently. <laughs> what do we have? We have uh, nine bikes. Very strong feeling that that's one of us. That's one of those things that makes David so great because he he knows this, all this stuff. So he's got visual library of it. So it's it's the first Monday after the entire team showed up this weekend. They all got here at like six in the morning. The overzealous blend friends, and uh, we're about to see if we can make an entire film in one week. I'm documenting it with my face. Tony's helping. Yep. That's, that's Tony. I've actually already completed the uh, the animatic for the film. Ah, yes, there we there it is. I'm pretty sure I can do. You want to see? It? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ah, uh, wait, 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 wait. Ah, come on. No, 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 no. Go back. There we go. <laughs> that's so stupid. Nicolo and Sebastian have just informed me that. Uh, Version control is not actually evil. I'm yet to be 100% convi convinced, but I'll, uh, I'll try it out. Oh, Rob, how the tables have turned. Yeah, I'm left. So how goes producing this, uh, this film? Well, pretty well, pretty well. Very buzzy, but uh, I like it. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty cool. Francisco has just made us spaghetti, <laughs> as the Italians do it. So we need I chopped the onions. Yo. Carton, nice. carton, carton, carton. I did nothing. <laughs> did nothing. I can make the documentary. I'll be honest. You cut tomatoes better than I would cut tomatoes. Yeah. What's up, so? <laughs> Though perhaps not as thoroughly. To this, if you will, a void of black. But suddenly, white text appears over this black. The end. <laughs> Where did these words come from? <laughs> Who knows?